Ligma yeah. balls. <laughs> <laughs> There's no continue. The the fun Ligma. thing about Ligma balls is that it's it's just an end. There's no begin. There doesn't need to be a beginning of the conversation, but that is the conversation ender. <laughs> ah, damn it! Oh, you were close. Oh, I was. You got this. Have you tried using the other weapons on him? No. I was gonna say try the electro web and see how that goes for you. The electro weapon, double cyclone. Or... Yeah, the light, the the lightning web. Oh, lightning web. All right. That's... Okay. Uh, so I'm, how just, I'm just thing? spitballing ideas because so far it looks like the basic blaster isn't really cutting it. Okay. I've been waiting to fight with you. Um... <laughs> I've been waiting to fight with you. Okay, that didn't do shit. He, he just blocked that it. one. Uh, soul body, maybe. Yeah, I don't think he'll be that. able to block that. Soul rubber. Soul rubber. Okay. So okay. yes, he can do shit. I... <laughs> All right. Uh, aiming laser, I guess. <laughs> what about the on, cyclone? Go... No. I'll go up. Right. Thank you. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Trying to select a goddamn weapon is a pain in the ass. Yeah. Nope. <laughs> nope. That is a new okay. shit. Also, nothing. Uh, doubles. Okay. I think. I think you might have to actually use the Buster here. Yeah. It looks like they it's might have just said. Ah! They might have just said, "Fuck you. You use the gun or die." Yeah. It doesn't do anything. Yeah. All right. Okay. So just, just shoot him. Yeah. Just, just Jump straight up shoot. shoot. Actually, we got the blaster upgrade. You can charge your special weapons now, can't you? God, that does so little damage. It's, yeah, no, like I said, it's pathetic. That one did slightly more. Um, do you have to charge your shot in order to actually damage him or no? Okay. Because honestly, I mean, I'm feeling like it might just be more advantageous to not bother charging, considering that it does so little damage and just, Yeah, you know. it might be a quantity, not quality of shot that affects yeah. him. Okay, I'd that, say nope. it just like, Right yeah, after just... he attacks, definitely try and just go for it. God damn, he's really fucking on your ass. Yes, he Fuck is! On your ass. It's one of those moves God. where they disappear and appear right in front of you. It's so cheap, I hate that. At the very least, it's pretty easy to predict. No, I'm like, I already have an ideal strategy with... in order to take on him. It's just... I just, hey, I hate that shit. Or it's like the snowman from Earthwork Jim. God dang it. <laughs> on me. I remember so, Earthworm Jim. Yeah, the fucking hey, snowman who also liked to appear in front of you. <laughs> it's so cheap. Earthworm Jim. <laughs> I like how he has like a different little quote every time you start the fight with him. Yeah, it's supposed to create a variety. It's supposed I to wish it just ran out. Ended. Like it just, you yeah, repeat it so many so times, you're just like, uh, fuck, I don't know, man. If he runs out, it'll probably just cycle back to an old one. Oh yeah, it'll definitely cycle back to an old one, but I wish before it, it would just go, uh, I don't know. Just I'm give really him no confidence. Here, pal. Dude, fucking beat me at some point. Look, I know I'm supposed to do this for like immersion and shit, but like, come on, pal. Come on, dude, you've got like this shit. Minutes. I got places to be too. I gotta die now. Listen, look, the sooner you kill me, the sooner I can get out of the script and get on with my life. Like, buddy, we've been here 30 minutes. Come on now. <laughs> the sooner you kill me, the sooner I can escape this mortal coil. The sooner you kill me, the sooner I can escape this mortal coil, which uh, ah, possesses yeah. my, ah, my, yeah. my, my yeah. soul. Ah, later. Later. Ah, spin squeak, it. Squeak, squeak, and he squeak, squeak. <laughs> Oh, it's Patrick Warburton! You fucking troglodyte! Damn! It's Patrick and the Warburtons, everybody. It's Patrick and the Warburtons. Dude, can that be our band? Can we make a band of just Patrick Warburton impressions and it could just be called Patrick and the Warburtons? <laughs> so, like, a lot of Waluigi, like, the same energy as, like, Waluigi bands? Only if we can actually get Patrick Warburton as the lead singer. It's <laughs> <laughs> uh, that would be no, Patrick ah. Warburton just plays bass. 
No, he's the Patrick. <laughs> he's the Patrick, and we're the Warburtons. Yeah, we're the Warburtons. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I trust Patrick and the Warburtons. Eh, eh. 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 Peter. Just random covers of, of songs, but all of us is Patrick Warburton. Oh my god, I hate Four no. part Patrick Warburton harmony. No. <laughs> it's funny that the only role I see, I just see the character and not Patrick Warburton is fucking Brock Samson from Venture Brothers. Yeah. That's because he's just Brock Samson. Brock Samson is Brock Samson. Brock Samson is not Patrick Warburton. There's Brock no yeah. Samson inhabits the form of... He just needs a vessel, and Patrick Warburton just happens to be that vessel. Patrick Warburton is Brock Samson's <laughs> vessel. Yeah. <laughs> like, I think he's... Patrick Warburton, Warburton is... is a mere flesh puppet for Brock Samson to channel his might. <laughs> Patrick Warburton is okay in like a couple things where it's like it's not too terribly noticeable. Like yeah, most of the time like oh it's Patrick Warburton, uh, but like him doing uh, Buzz Lightyear in the uh, cartoon was pretty. Man. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that, that was, was pretty good. good. But, like if you can't get Tim Allen, Patrick Warburton was a pretty. He's a good, good replacement. Ah, Although yeah. like okay, here's the so I was watching the movie. Uh, the Buzz Lightyear Starman movie because I need to. Um, Are you serious? And like, I can't escape like, fucking, from this. Ugh. You really can't. It's you're stuck here. Great. It's Patrick Warburton is not in that. It's Tim Allen, and I'm like, man, I would have been fine if it was just fucking Patrick Warburton at this point because the disconnect yeah. between the show and the and the and the TV movie when you go from Tim Allen to Patrick Warburton. Yeah, the TV movie starting. is Warburton, and the movie movie is t is Tim Allen. <laughs> Yeah. Well, technically, the the TV movie, which is like the the Adventure Begins, is the one with Tim Allen, but it was the pilot, pretty much. And then the no, series. No, here's the up. thing. There's two versions of the pilot movie thing. There's oh, the yeah, one with Tim Allen, and then there's the one with Warburton. And, oh yeah. Yeah. Fucker. I'm pretty sure the reasoning behind that is just, hey, Patrick Warburton is actually voicing Buzz Lightyear in the series. Let's just dub him over in the film, so it's not which, so yeah. weird for people. Which, yeah, I, I think that the Which version with Tim Allen is better. Yeah. yeah. But, like, the disconnect been watching a couple episodes of the show, which I, I've decided, fuck no, I'm not watching 24 hours of Buzz Lightyear Star Command for the retrospective. I have enough shit to watch that talking about 24 hours of cartoon that has nothing to do with the rest of the series, I'm good God, just talking dude. about the movie. <laughs> like, it's a good show. Fair. But fuck no, I'm not watching 24 hours to say it's a good show. Hmm. Uh, but it, it's 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 a little weird because I'm just so used to Tim Allen. Ooh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, shots even doing any damage because it doesn't look like it. Ah, well that one missed, so it definitely didn't. <laughs> You're a dick. Ah, oh, damn it. Well that one killed you, so that one didn't either. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> you're you're whittling him down. I'm I'm seeing his health bar going farther and farther down each time. Yeah. I'll show you no mercy. Now get ready. <laughs> <laughs> I'll show you no mercy. The way he talks. The, the, the Japanese really bled through in that line. <laughs> he sounded like, like a fucking samurai, bro. I will show you no mercy. <gasps> Mega Man's like, yo, bro, are you okay? Your Japanese is showing. <laughs> it's kind of like fucking Ace Attorney, where it's like definitely Japan, but I, I fucking they're like that it, Ace it's San Francisco. Had an anime. They're like it's San Francisco, and it's like everything about this is Japan. Japan Francisco. It really Japan. is. Jap I think that's what they what Japan some fans have called is Japan Francisco. I mean, there's San Francisco from Big Hero Six, which I remember San is Francisco. still one of the most rad fucking designs for a city. Like, yeah. yeah, like San Francisco is just a really cool like looking San place Francisco, in animated movies. If it, if it was built by Nintendo, <laughs> and for Nintendo. Oh God, yeah. What? It just went through him. 
Yeah, I think he was still, like, fucking phase teleporting ah. or whatever the fuck he calls it. Ah, Gen fuck. Genesis does what San Frintendo don't. I'm gonna pretend you didn't say that, Robin. I wish I could, but I won't. Hey, Robin, you saw Fast and Furious 9, right? No, I haven't! Shut up! Oh, okay, I was gonna, well, apparently <laughs> there... Fast and Furious no, 9. Please. This isn't about Fast and Furious 9 itself. It's the fact that apparently, like, uh, Universal or something is, like, they're not uploading, like, the teaser trailer for uh, Jurassic World Dominion. They're making exclusive for, like, certain viewings of Fast and Furious 9. I think it's, like, the IMAX re version or something. I don't know. Some I mean, shit like that. Didn't kind of a common practice. Kind of, like, bomb. I have not <laughs> seen, and I have, I have been, blo I have blocked almost all mentions of Fast 9 on my Twitter timeline, because I don't want anyone fucking spoiling it for me. I want to go see that movie. Fuck! Uh, but, up, like, but, like, the thing about, like, oh, trailers aren't being uploaded, that's kind of, unfortunately, a kind of common practice where um, where trailers will be like, hey, if you want to go and see this trailer, you got to go to the IMAX screen, this exclusive IMAX preview. I remember there was now a fucking... I'm not going to see the trailer, and because of that, I'm not going to see your movie, so who really lost, dumbass? Well, then... Eventually, they're going to put it up on YouTube. But, like, there was a five-minute trailer for uh, Tenant. There was, like, a scene from Tenant, and you could only see it if you went to the IMAX version of the of Star Wars Episode Nine. It's like, hey, if you go see Star Wars Episode Nine, you get five minutes of Tenant you can go see before the movie. Which, That's such a fucking stupid practice. Like, what? I mean, okay, I, I pay more money so I can see five minutes of another movie? I came here to see this one. I always no, kind of like do a fucking second one. I mean, I'm cool with it just in case, just for like the month exclusivity that they usually do for. Because it literally was like a month later that they put it on YouTube. It's like, oh, you know, I, if, I'm, I if I don't know that's about a it, really I'm... stupid fucking practice, though. Yeah, if, if I don't know like, that there's oh, like a exclusive <laughs> preview, nobody has heard about is getting a preview. How do I know what this movie's gonna be about? Uh, you don't. You have to sit here and pay more money to see if it will even be worth your time later on. Yeah. I mean, Jurassic World doesn't come out until, like, December or some shit. And there mm. will be fucking... No, it comes out next it. year in June. Wow. Oh, shit. They're gonna market... They're no. gonna market the fuck out of that movie. It's Jurassic <laughs> fucking Park. It's coming around sometime a uh, holiday, which probably means Christmas. Get which means ready. next year. Honestly, I'm no, expecting actually, it to get pushed 20, back. It said holiday 2021, and it's been pushed back for 2020 already. Listen, I'm... I would not be surprised if they were like... Multiplayer is done. We want a little bit more work on the campaign. Campaign is going to be in a couple Honestly, months. If that's, if that's the case, I wouldn't mind. If it's like, all right, here's the multiplayer. We've got that out. You can play it all you want while we finish up the campaign. Here you go. I'd be cool if with they, it. If they did that, I feel like a lot of people would be like, okay, yeah, sure. We have something to occupy ourselves in the meantime. And you guys, and you guys are actually fixing the product. So. Was was I mean, there like some development shit behind the scenes that like led it to being pushed back to 2021 in the first place or something? Oh, you mean like coronavirus and how everything has been delayed? That was no, it, it wasn't. No, this was more than just uh, COVID. This was like shit, like how they were they were like overworking people and bringing in all these like outside help to, to like rush this game and shit. It, from what I remember, the initial pushback, so it was going to be 2020, a yes. holiday. The initial pushback happened a year earlier um, when the first dem the first footage was shown at E3 2019. They were like, hey, here's Halo Infinite. This is what we've been working on. It's like kind of early in development or it's like about a year out from finishing. And people online lost their fucking minds because of some screenshots that they took of it. They're like, this game's ugly. This is terrible. Why does it look like this? So and they're like, okay. The reason behind that was because, yeah, they, they were actually using an older build of the game. They hadn't. Yeah. Actually, they weren't actually using the most recent build that they had. Oh yeah. And people were losing their fucking minds over it. And then they're like, no, no, no. Look, this is this is what we have right now. This is just the most stable one. Yeah. And then they Halo released the free shots that were very fucking pretty because the lighting actually did its job. Yeah. So they were Halo fans serious. cyber. Halo fans cyberbully 343 so hard the director quit. Halo fans cyberbullied 343 so hard they went back to Bungie style. Pretty much, yeah. That's what fucking happened. Also, apparently the team behind Halo 5 uh, got fired, like, behind the story of it. 
Which sucks, kind of. Like, uh, you know... Not really, the story was It's not a great... It. It's not a great game, but, like, being like, Hey, this is the what we worked on. The was fun. The story was fucking dog water. It was poo-poo. 